Hi guys, welcome back to my channel English in a Blink and today I'm going to look at prepositional phrases. So prepositional phrase, you know, it's just a group of words that begins with a preposition. Easy, right? Well, they are just, you know, fixed sort of expressions. So if you will remember them, that's going to be really handy. Okay, so the first one for today is under construction. So if I say a new railroad is under construction, that means, um, you know, they are building it. It's not built yet, but it is under construction. Okay, then the second one is when you say, oh, for real. So after two trial runs, we did it for real. So <clears throat> real, that means it, you, you did it. Um, it was not a trial anymore. It was in reality that you did something. Okay, so for real. Then at the same time, all speak at the same time. So sometimes that happens, right? There are lots of people and they just start speaking at the same time. Not good. Okay, so if you're in class, I don't like when people, you know, my students, they all speak at the same time. So I'm like, I'm lost people one by one. Okay, <clears throat> sorry about that. All right, then we have by the time. So by the time I got there, he'd gone. Okay, so by the time, uh, and let's say you had a time, so nine o'clock, you had to read, so by the time. So by that time, that's what it means, by the time. Then we have, by the way. So by the way, how is John? So you know, when you're talking about something and then in the middle of something, you remember, oh, by the way. Okay, so um, it's, it's like when you're changing like the topic or you, you remember something out of the blue. Oh, by the way, how is that person or how, how is so and so or how are things? Okay, so that's when you, you can use your by the way. Then on paper. So could you put your ideas down on paper? So, you know, when, when you're actually writing down something on paper. Okay, I want everything. So you say, oh, I want this, this, this. And then the person says, you know what? I want all of that on paper because you might just deny later. Okay, it's on paper, written. Then with regret. So do not waste time with regret. So that means don't, don't regret. I mean, you're wasting your time regretting something. Okay, so don't waste your time with regret. Um, okay at a discount i'm sure all of you know that right at a discount so when when you enjoy something so employees can buy books at a discount so if you're working in a bookstore i'm sure you're going to enjoy your discount or anywhere that you work let's say if you're working in a merchandise so you will be enjoying your discount on clothes all right without a hitch so everything had gone without a hitch. So without a hitch, like without any problems. Okay, so hitch is like a problem. If you're doing something, we had hitches here and there, hiccups. So hitch is like a problem. Okay, so without a hitch, no problem at all. Okay, then we have under treatment. So under treatment, so so-and-so uh, is under treatment for malaria. Well, at the moment, I think... Uh, they're going to be under treatment for COVID. Okay, so you're always under treatment for whatever that you are under treatment for. All right, then by force. He took the purse from her by force. That means, I mean, you, you had to apply some force, all right? So by force. I mean, of course, imagine um, a robber who's trying to rob your um you so you're not going to be giving it oh yeah there you go so he has to apply some force okay it's by force all right then on board he tried to jump back on board <clears throat> so when you're talking about on board sometimes uh you know let's say people um they give you an idea and uh, and are you on board with me? I mean, are you on this with me? So when you say, oh, I'm on board, that means, yeah, um, I agree. And I am with you on this plan, whatever we are working on together. Okay, so I'm on board. All right, then at risk, he was putting himself at risk. I mean, at the moment, if you're going out without a mask, you are at risk, right? So do not put yourself at risk. Okay, then we have by nature. He was by nature a philosophical person. Okay, so when you talk about someone's nature, so then and you're telling, so then you'll say, oh, by nature, he was a philosophical person or 
whatever his nature was. Then we have in vain. Okay, so when you say in vain, uh, his efforts were in vain. So when something is in vain, that means uh, it was not fruitful. It, it was it was futile. Mm -mm. Uh, it didn't work. It didn't work at all. It was all useless. <clears throat> okay, in vain. And then we have in debt. So I'm in debt to the bank for my car loan. That's not bad. That's not nice, right? When you're in debt, that means you owe some money, okay? So you owe, owe some money to someone or uh, like a favor to someone. So that's when you are in debt. Someone did something for you. So then now you are in debt, okay? Then uh, the last one for today is for life. I believe marriage is for life. That means forever, okay? So that's when you can say... On marriage or whatever you think is for life that's when you can use this for life all right so these were certain uh, prepositional phrase I hope you like them and if you did like I always say just press that like button spread the word share it with your friends until we meet next time bye for now